Kavya. Hi, Bhumi. Uh, I just want to start off by saying that I am extremely excited to be in conversation with you. Uh, I have been reading up about all the work that you've done, and honestly, when I was eleven, I could barely switch on a computer. And here you are coding and using all your knowledge for betterment of our planet. You know, to make our society better. I I really want to know where has this inspiration come from? You know, let's start from the beginning. How old were you when you started your journey? I was introduced to the world of coding uh, via Scratch Junior, which my mom taught me. Um, and when she held a summer camp in my building to teach my friends Scratch Junior, I became an assistant. And uh, the next summer, I actually ran the summer camp myself. I first got formal training in coding at Camp K12, where I learned Android app development. And then a little bit after that, I started learning coding at White Hat Junior. Um, and I've been learning coding there for about more than a year now. And it's been a great experience so far. It's opened up. a whole new world of possibilities and challenges for me it fascinates me how we can use logic to solve real world problems that we see around us uh my next question to you is so you developed this app called nudge i primarily want to understand what is the app about where did the inspiration to start this app come from what kind of changes have you seen once you launched it So obviously climate change is a problem which needs no introduction for most of us nowadays because I think we can see it its impact in our daily lives from people dying in deadly heat waves in Canada to severe flooding in Europe that is destroying livelihoods to even the largest wildfire in the history of the USA among all these scenes of destruction and suffering what really gave me hope was all the kinds of innovations happening in india and all over the world that were helping tackle problems like global warming and climate change to name a few examples uh, carbon negative bricks that are made from agricultural waste 60000 miles of road made in india out of recycled plastic biodiesel made from chicken waste i was also really influenced by the nudge theory which was conceptualized by mr richard taller who is a nobel laureate so i put all of these ideas together and came up with the simple yet powerful idea of nudge which is i would say a smart app which tries to positively influence the behavior and decision making of individuals to help them achieve their climate goals through easy and fun challenges the purpose of this app is to start a climate campaign by encouraging people to live more sustainably all the challenges in this app are carefully chosen to save energy water and trees to promote reusing recycling and healthy living to manage food waste and garbage so basically what the app does is it throws fun and exciting challenges at the user and the user collects points to increase her sustainability quotient or sq points by attempting those challenges and ultimately these challenges will enable the user to reduce his or her carbon footprint by making small and really simple changes in the way they live eat and even travel each challenge also comes with a really inspiring do you know fact that will incentivize or inspire the user to take up the challenge which is another of the nudge theory's tactics each challenge also has an additional link which could open for example google maps which will show the directions to the nearest say vegan restaurant or wow. an amazon to let the user buy more sustainable products that are related to or on the same lines as the challenge and of course you might be wondering so there's also an artificial com- intelligence component that validates the image that the user uploads as proof of attempting that challenge before they're able to collect the points and also the users can compare their scores with others using the leaderboard feature of the app which shows the top 5 users and their highest scores wow kavya wow and you know you've done all of this and you've achieved and you've created this phenomenal app i want to know what's in the future for you what's in the pipeline for you because i know you want to or you are an entrepreneur already in the near future i want to do a project which will help connect 
the various technological innovations that are helping fight climate change to the common person. So I want to connect, I want to make these green products more accessible. It'll be sort of like a sustainable marketplace. There are dozens of young Indians coming up with wonderful innovations every single day. And I want to connect people to these innovations and ideas and products in the distant future. Of course, I want to help fight climate change on a global scale with the help of technology. Um, you know, when I speak to young climate warriors like you, uh, I feel like there's still a lot of hope. Is there anything that you want to end this conversation with? Is there anything that you want to talk about? Any message that you want to give out? I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for creating this series because I have watched a few episodes and it's really inspirational. To the young kids watching this out there, I would like to say that Everyone has their own unique way of contributing to society and their own different skill sets. If you have a cause that you really passionately believe in, then you will definitely be able to make a difference in the society. I can actually speak with you every day. <laughs> this, this conversation has me so inspired and I feel like whatever little I've been doing isn't enough. Kara, thank you so much. I really hope that, you know, uh, we speak very soon about some new app that you've developed about all your future contributions and all the best. And thank you so much for all your service. No, I'm so grateful to be a part of this and thank you for giving me this opportunity. See you. I hope to see you soon. Very soon. <laughs>